A 68-year-old missing woman who was found deceased in southeast Bakersfield is talking with 17 News tonight about the agony of their two-week search for answers. 17's Michaela Armstrong reports. A family was on the hunt to find a loved one. Now they are on the hunt to find out what led to that loved one's death. The door is not closed yet. I still need more answers. 68-year-old Anna Marie Baker was last seen on July 17th near her home on Clyde Street. According to her family, Baker had dementia and a series of other health problems and feared the worst could happen to her if they didn't find her. That biggest fear came true. The last two weeks of her life, she didn't deserve that. Finding her in the middle of the nowhere... It kills me. According to the Bakersfield Police Department, officers located a dead woman near Watts Drive on July 31st. After an investigation by the coroner's office, it was confirmed Baker was that woman. The investigation showed there is no evidence of foul play, but the family isn't so convinced. I feel like somebody got scared and they dumped her. I feel like somebody was holding her body the whole time. With their questions growing after the family says they learned from the coroner Monday, that Baker was found in a rug near a ditch. To me, that's kind of remorse, someone who cared for her. Because if it was just somebody who wanted to dump her, they just would have just threw her off the truck and kept going. Now the family is on a quest to understand what happened to Anna Baker and why the family had to learn about her finding from the news and social media rather than the police. I just thought when people die, you get a knock or on the door, a phone call. Sorry, you know, we found her, but... We now, they told everybody in the world but us. They let us down. I would say they let our family down in this case. We reached out to BPD, and in a statement, a spokesperson said, in cases where there doesn't appear to be any foul play involved, the coroner's office will handle most of the communications. Kayla Armstrong, 17 News.